Hey, Vsauce, Nesthead here, back with another episode of Jacksepticeye's Funniest Home Videos. This time, my little elves have been all over the world. Before, they went all over the internet to try and find the funniest home videos that we could possibly laugh to, but this time, they went all the way to Japan. That's right, Konichiwa! <laughs> Anyway, today we're going to be looking at weird Japanese commercials because let's face it, Japanese commercials are the best commercials that the world has to offer all the time. They're amazing. I've, I've well, I have some compilations here that I'm going to look through that I think are going to be good. Um, they, they, this is suggested by somebody to try and react to some of these because they get a little crazy. But I've probably seen some of them, just not all of them. But I hope they make us laugh. Okay. Weird, funny, and cool Japanese commercials. What? 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 What are you teaching the kids? Okay, 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 okay. You know what? I thought I was ready. I thought, oh, they're gonna be weird, but nothing can be that weird. It's not gonna be that crazy that's gonna make me speechless. First video. <laughs> Holy crap, okay. I need to reconvene in my head. I need to back off, jack off, and regroup, and come back to this, like, with a better mentality, because I am not ready. Okay, in through the nose. Out through the mouth. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, lay it on me, Buttercup. Oh, yes! <laughs> oh, I love this. I want dogs to be able to talk. I owe those stuff. What? <laughs> Wait, what was that for? <laughs> what was I just sold? I mean, I love it. I, w I want to buy it, whatever it is. Just tell- I, I need to know what that was. I don't know. <laughs> it was just a talking dog in space, and then he was able to talk down to the lady in the air. What? I'm into this one. This one's incredible. Galbo twist. Yes, I agree. Garbo <laughs> twist. I want some Garbo twists. They look delicious. They look like um Takis Fuego. Fuego. I want some now. God, I'm hungry. Oh, don't record. I I fail to realize that most Japanese commercials are all about food, and I should not record these things while I'm hungry. Strong zero. What? Why did it work on him and not her? Wait, what? No, hold on. Stop. Wait, what? Stop. I didn't even have a chance to figure out what the fuck was going on. Okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Okay, she drank it, sprayed water all over him. That's hot. Then he drank it, nothing happened, got cock blocked, and I you know what? Let's move on. We don't need to understand what's going on. So accept the guy's funniest home videos, not Jack Accept the Guys. What the hell was that? That's a great series idea. Write it down! Bruce, Why is Bruce Willis in someone's what? Bruce Willis speaks Japanese! I- no, I need- I need more of that in my life. Go back. I want to hear Bruce Willis speaking Japanese again. Daihatsu Mira Ish! I just was beating on his head! This is the greatest thing that has ever happened to me! <laughs> Oh, Bruce, I hope you got paid well for that. <laughs> that is so out of character for him. 
He's normally like so stone faced and doesn't give a shit about anything anymore. Ace! <laughs> yes! Yes! I love these ones! The banana ones! <laughs> it's incredible! It's the world's greatest piece of art that has ever been created. There's more of them. There's more of them. We should watch another one. There he is. He's a working man. He's a people's man. He is Banana Man. <laughs> I love it. It's just such wholesome content. Thank you, Banana Man. You saved our business. What am I buying? S. U. Toothpaste. Are we buying toothpaste? We are. I still don't know. Is that super glue or toothpaste? That's a very big misunderstanding. Because if I brush my teeth with super glue, then, well, actually, I'll shut up like everybody wants me to. So, that'll probably be good. Maybe I should buy some of that and brush it on my teeth. And then I start like this forever. <laughs> I already love this. <laughs> Do you ever find yourself half stuck in a wall, trying to get to Hogwarts, but the train leaves before you can get through the wall? Me too. <laughs> oh, what are you selling? Please be selling. Is this like an ad for condoms? What? <laughs> Was that for like an escape room or a prison or something? <laughs> I still like to think it's for condoms. It's like it's almost got through, but it didn't. You're not pregnant. Calm down, okay? I know. You you are not the father, mother, person. <laughs> Game boy! Pokemon Monster? Pocket Monster? Monster, Zembu de Hakogoju Shuri, Tushin Cable de Monster, Waikaeko, Super Game Boy in Arakara. Is this how they sold Pokemon back in the day? This is terrible. Pocket the Monster. That was not good. <laughs> she said something about Pokemon, and then they were like, No, get out of here, you fucking weirdo. And then she was like, Ay! I do not want to play Pokemon more after seeing that commercial. That was a bad commercial. Maybe laugh though, so I guess it works. Graphite <laughs> <laughs> fucking glasses! Everything's made out of pencil lead! Or graphite! <laughs> Are you using, using graphite to cut their cake? What the fuck? That is the best way I've ever seen someone try to sell me graphite. <laughs> Actually, it's the only way anyone has ever tried to sell me graphite. I want a big stockpile of graphite from now on. If you meet me at a convention, if you meet me on tour, if you meet me anywhere, just give me graphite. Actually, no, don't, because people will take that seriously. People people have sent me weirder things uh, by me saying a joke, so don't send me that shit! I just think that that's hilarious. Wait, why did he have graphite under his arm? <laughs> They're pop bombs are just pieces of pencil lead. I'm surprised his hair is some pencil lead. I don't know what that meant. What was written on that? She just said Kominasai. And then ran away, so obviously she didn't take the proposal. Why? Why is it in his arm? <laughs> is he using it? Is he trying to break it? Look at his fucking glasses. <laughs> Oh, Japan, you're the best. Ah. Graphite proposal. So, he tried to get- he tried to ask the other girl out with graphite and she said no. Broke his little pencil heart. It's, his heart's in the shape of graphite. And then... He moved on and then he found someone with graphite glasses and asked her out and they lived graphite ever after. I wanna know what that part means. Because everything was great, everything was wonderful, and then they started taking graphite, and then she said something about it being like, By the way, graphite's shit, and it won't actually do any of the things you just said. And then they were like, NANI?! Kirin! Kirin Ichiban! My favorite Japanese beer, right after Asahi. This is, this is bad. That was terrible. That's not a weird Japanese commercial. It's not cool, funny, or weird. It's just regular. 
That's what you'd see here. Next commercial. I have the weirdest boner right now. Okay, stop yelling at me. <laughs> This is the evolution of the E meme. E! I don't know what's going on, but I like this one. This one has a horse in a subway and a man who looks out of time. This is a recipe for greatness. He's not saying anything. None of them are saying anything. <laughs> that's my move. That's how that's how I get the ladies, you know, walking down a subway. I'm like, do you like my horse? Look at my muscle! Look at it! Look! Watch! And then they're like, ah! It's too much! This is so creepy! No one else is stopping him either! Let's just check out my bicep. Check- you can watch E.T. on my bicep. Watch it! What the fuck was that? I need to go home after that one. That was uncomfortable. Come here, come here, come here, come here, Sawa. <laughs> oh, I'm so uncomfortable. <laughs> I'm gonna see that in my nightmares. <laughs> what? What the fuck is happening? <laughs> What was that? I thought this was a commercial for fridges. Why did you need to bring the fridge with you? Oh no! I'm low on graphite. <laughs> I have to go into the forest. <laughs> Don't you hate it when you run out of graphite in your fridge? You gotta run into the forest with it on your back like Indiana Jones or Mr. Fredrickson from Up. Yeah, that's a tough life. But then you reach the forbidden forest. And you see Graphite Man in his little hut that he's built out of clay. So you get it from the source. What is this? What was that? Is that like soy sauce or something? <laughs> oh fuck. Why was it so ridiculously stupid? The first two seconds of this is the greatest thing I've ever seen! Holy shit! <laughs> what the fuck is happening? What were you selling? Is that a like gum? I just have bang, backflip. <laughs> I need to see it again. Are they fighting over which gum is better? And then he comes out with his own, and they're like, oh, okay. Oh my god. That really fucking got me. I did not like that. Someone, somewhere, is aroused by what just happened. And that makes me more uncomfortable than anything that actually happened in the video. Oh wait, it was me! Is that Majin Buu? Oh god, no. Meiji. Chocolato. Okay, I- that- I feel like I just witnessed a crime, okay? Some dude went into the forest, found Mushroom Baby, gave him some chocolate, and then the baby started patting him. I feel like a police officer is on his way to my house right now. Okay, so he pointed to him that- I have several questions. Why were you on a different planet? 
Why did you bring chocolate to the kid? Why did you give the kid the chocolate? Why did the alien baby pat you on the- <laughs> And then why did you point at the earth to say there's more chocolate down there? The baby took off and left with fart magic And then you're left on a foreign planet with chocolate Also, you lied to the kid. You told him that you didn't have any more You said that you didn't have any more chocolate Ah If only the kid had patted my ass He would have found the chocolate can I call Chris Hansen on this guy? Oh, oh god! Oh Jesus! <laughs> that went- oh my god! That escalated so fast! I didn't even have time to catch my breath. I thought that that was going to be a commercial for Fortnite dance emotes. Then, BAM! This is your brain on drugs. <sighs> it's like Pale Man from Pan's Labyrinth. <sighs> okay, I I need a cup of tea or something. I need a break. I need to get away from my computer for like at least 72 hours. I have no idea what just happened. This was- I thought that this was going to be funnier than it was. <laughs> I thought that I was going to laugh at a bunch of these. A lot of this video was me going, what the fuck? <laughs> Anyway, if nothing else, I hope that you learned something here today. I hope you learned to get your hair cut in time, or else you're gonna end up with this. But for now, my elves, they must leave. They must go forward on another journey to find more of Jacksepticeye's funniest home videos. But until then, good night, everybody! Don't forget to graphite that like button.